My decision was very simple. You know, after talking over my family, my friends, uh, my coaching staff, I'm going to return next year for school. With the eyes of the nation on him once again, Ohio State quarterback Cardell Jones surprises many once again by announcing he will not enter the NFL draft this year. That decision about much more than his career. News Channel 5's John Kosick spoke with Cardell after the announcement. He is live at Ginn Academy tonight. And John, Cardell knew he was sending a strong message about education. Yeah, Chris said it was a message that no teacher or administrator could send. But while Cardell knew it was going to reach a lot of kids, there was only one kid that he was looking to reach. While Cardell Jones was announcing to the country that he was staying at Ohio State, choosing education over a football payday, the person who had the biggest impact on that decision was sleeping. Meet Chloe Michelle, Jones's infant daughter, who at 10 weeks old is already daddy's little girl. Did you think about her when you made this decision? Yeah, definitely, definitely. You know, I always want to set up not just me but my family for the best, you know, opportunities that come down the road and hopefully I'll be able to take advantage of them opportunities. It was something he talked about with Ted Ginn Sr. when making his decision. You know, he wanted to be the example for his daughter, you know, so I already know that played a big part in it. Ginn said he was proud of Cardell's choice and the message it sends to students that education is more important than money. If you chase a dollar that it's limited, you know, that degree is not limited. Equally proud is Michelle Nash, who helped raise Cardell. She's got it in through so many decisions, but this one, she says, had to be his. Because it's his life. I told him to pray about it and go from there. And that's what he said he did. The choice is one that his girlfriend and Chloe's mom, Janae, also stands behind. I felt like it was the right decision. I mean, it's three games, so I feel like he'll be more ready next, next year. Yes, to be clear, he is returning for an education, but also for football. I could just get so much better in this offseason and hopefully, you know, become a starter and uh, projected, you know, early first round or something like that. But you also got to look at the flip side of that. What if I don't? What he knows for sure is returning to Ohio State and not preparing for the NFL draft will mean more time with Chloe. I'm going to make sure I see her every weekend since we don't have weekends on games. So she, um, uh, <laughs> miss her. <laughs> And he's got a couple more days with her. He returns to class at Ohio State on Tuesday. Spring football practice starts in March. Live in Cleveland, Jack Hasek, News Channel 5.